three, two. What is going on, everybody? Kenny, Customizer Depot here. And today on Experimenting with Kenny, I'm going to discuss the differences between the Max Matte Extra Matte Top Coat, which dries on colorless, and the Max Edge Pro Protecting Gloss Finishers by Giardini. So uh, I just made this leather, uh, this leather watch band. Uh, with uh, Louis Vuitton material, so I made that. But it, this one, I did the finisher in, vet, in red. If you haven't seen this video, I'm gonna link it so that way you guys can take a look at it. And what I'm gonna be doing is I'm gonna be putting the max mat on uh, the max mat top coat on the shorter strap, and then I'm gonna be putting the protecting gloss on one side of the longer strap. Now, the reason why I wanna do that is I just wanna showcase what happens when you put that on, like the difference in the color. It may not seem like a lot, but it is to me and my eyes. And I just wanted to showcase that to you guys and, and, and really show you. What this also does is that it offers an extra layer of protection onto the dense edge paint that you're gonna be working. So that color the, for the red is gonna be the color red 80. Uh, if you guys are interested, this is a great color. I really love this color on the uh, on, on this particular type of watch brand, that brown and red with the, with the Louis material looks really, really nice to me, which is why I wanted to show that to you guys. So now, right, I'm, I just finished that matte side. Now I wanna put on protective gloss. So on one side of the long strap, I just wanna show you guys like the difference. So again, this is just, uh, to me, it's two different, it's three different colors. The three colors that you'll get is the regular, red 80 that I, that I, that's on it right now, the way that it looks glossy and the way that it looks extra matte. To me, there's a huge difference. And again, you just wanna really just put on the, put on the coats uh, the same way that you normally would put on the dense edge base coat, the regular dense edge paint and, and, and so on and so forth. You just wanna keep it regular. So right there, you see that that's your baseline. Your baseline is what it did before. And now what I'm gonna do is I'm just gonna let this cure. You wanna let, you wanna let this cure for at least, I wanna say a little bit more than 20 minutes, especially the, the gloss. The gloss is gonna take like about an hour uh, to fully cure. Um, usually what I would do is I like to take a blade to the, uh, to the leather edge. And uh, you know, like that shows you like how durable and how crazy that paint stays on and it doesn't come off, right? So right there, I don't know. And I'm gonna put a side-by-side -side comparison so that way you guys can see the color and the color difference of like the natural red 80 as well as that extra matte and as well as, so this is, like this is the long strap that we were playing around with earlier that had the gloss, right? So you'll be able to see the difference between, because the gloss literally shines a little bit extra, right? So you'll see that, Oof, you'll see that shine. That shine pops out and it's beautiful, it's great. But what if you just wanted the regular color like that? And now, boom, you see that there's a difference. There's like a muted tone in that red. So this is what I wanted to showcase to you guys. If you wanted an extra layer of protection, what you're gonna get, you're gonna get something like this. You're gonna either get the really high gloss or you're gonna get like that matte color. Uh, this is this is what you're looking at. You're looking at like a like a muted tone for the uh, for the red, and you're also looking for that extra that extra gloss. So again, all these are is they're just an added extra layer of protection for the leather edge that you're working on. So if you're working on a purse, you're working on a wallet, a passport holder, anything, make sure that if you're gonna be using Giardini leather edge paint, that you check out like what the difference is gonna look like with the paint. And this is exactly what I'm showcasing to you guys. And again, this is all experimental. I'm just playing around and this is me just having fun. But again, I wanted to thank you guys so much for coming and hanging out. Uh, in the event that you guys found this video informative, please hit the like button. If you want to show this to your friends and they're like, if they work with leather edges and things like that, make sure that you share this video uh, to them and or to like-minded individuals. We totally appreciate it. Uh, definitely go check out 
uh, customizerdepot.com if you wanted to see any of the other cool stuff that we do make. Uh, if you wanted to check us out on social media, we're at Customizer Depot on almost everything on all platforms. So again, guys, thank you so much for coming and hanging out. We totally appreciate you guys. And I leave you with this. Keep crafting, you know, keep doing what you love. Thanks a lot, guys. Have a great day. Thank <laughs> you.